guys, Jess here. Welcome back to another Miraculous Ladybug video today. And there's a brand new update! <laughs> uh, I should have recorded this uh, the other day, but I was um, feeling a bit unwell. Anyways, it's been a big week for us Miraculous fans, but I'll get into that later on. Anyways, we got a brand new update with a brand new character on the quest stand. Now, if you see here, it is Safari. Natalie's the customization in Season 5. Now, to unlock her, uh, you must start a lobby. You must start a battle from the the new lobby. All right, we'll check that out in in a second. Win three battles and cook a recipe. Ooh, cooking recipes. All right, and for time quest, you have Monarch 2.0. For this time, for this one, you have to collect ten thousand lady charms, just like Kid Noir from last week. All right, now. Okay, so, so, and I'm looking at the bug fixes. Okay, Garrett will now transform into its white suit to Mark Tipper now. That was the issue from last week's video, which, I, which, uh, that, that wasn't, um, that wasn't there yet. Alright, and also, miraculous, su miraculous superheroes will now automatically level up after a fight if XP conditions are met. Okay, so now, so, so, so then we don't have to auto, um, auto level up ourselves. Okay, cool. Now, uh, let's see what's new here. I'm looking at the, uh, notes here from Toya. So far, has joined the quest stand. New place, fighting lobby, and perform mega acclimatizations and purifications of Safari and play with the new RP tool. Okay, so I'm assuming RP's... I'm assuming Safari's RP tool will be a, um... What is it? A... A bow? Like a bow and arrow type deal? Anyways, uh, the fighting, a new place has been added, the fighting lobby, located near the cinema, which is the one we see right here. Uh, the fighting lobby will act as a hub, uh, for all things fighting related. Upgrade and unlock new superpowers, participate in new fight, new fighting events, and interact with fresh new content. Alright, before that, let's head to the Zag store to check out the characters for this week. I should probably just uh, turn off my name display. All right, Gamer 2.0, Multi Noir, and Roger. I'm wondering if they should add new clothing. I wish Toya would add some new stuff for their um, in their new um, avatar shops. All right, let's get on with it. Lobby. Ooh, I like the little posters too. Yep, they removed the little stuff right here. All right. Fighting lobby. Ooh, this is actually pretty good. Hmm. The leaderboard. Okay, so there's no leaderboards here yet. Miraculous powers. Okay, cat and ladybug coming soon. That is the. Ooh, the turtle miraculous and the ox miraculous, and as well as the uh, fox. Okay, I see B. I don't know what that is. I think that could be snake. At least I think that's a snake. This is time, and this is mouse. I can't tell what that is. I don't think that's snakes. I know that's turtles, and that's a nose ring for ox, I believe. But I can't tell what this is. The only thing I can think of is, is snake, because 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 of the color. All right, now for the gotcha. Oh. Oh oh, we can't do it. No, I, I I guess the gotcha doesn't work here. At least not yet. The training room. Ooh, the lounge. Oh, that is cool. Oh, we get. Oh, whoop, that's a bug. That's definitely a bug. Okay, then. <laughs> More dancing. Can I... Okay, so these are from Agent's room, and there's a popcorn machine. There we go. Ah. Oh yeah, we finally have reached over 900,000. And of course the unicorn, we already saw that. 
So this is the training room. Can we go in there? Yes, we can! Ooh. Name. Coming soon. Ah! Water. You know, for breaks. I can hear my siblings. Okay, so this is where you, where you practice by shooting your powers. You have, uh... Gla Glaciator, Stormy Weather, Panel Team, and those little ice... Ice... Uh, characters. Alright. Let's exit out. And, okay. Some weather statue. Ooh, new fighting coming soon. Ladybug. I mean, Tiki. Hmm. Alright, well, let's start this. I'm looking at... Start about from the lobby. Three. Three. Penalty challenge. Okay, let's just go with... Let's start with regular old penalty. I'm the only one in my private server. Because, yeah, that's it. And looks like I got the ability. Tiki, blossoming ladybug. Let's go. Alright, here we go. What's up, ladybug? Listen, this is my. I am getting paralyzed. Well, now it's a good time to talk. Um, okay, let me lower the volume so people can hear me. So, now it's a good time to talk. Uh, it's probably best to say this. Um, I'm recording this after the day after the Miraculous Ladybug uh, film has just released in um, in uh, on Netflix. <laughs> I, I keep forgetting. Uh, it just released yesterday. I, I was planning on watching it, but I felt nauseous and sick, so. I have to watch it today on 29. So yeah, it is out on Netflix right now. It actually reached uh, number one in in here in the U.S. and and I believe in Paris as well as uh, in other locations. Uh, Jeremy Zach posted it, which is pretty amazing. Pretty amazing how after 24 hours of it being released on Netflix, newly released, obviously, uh, it, it reached number one in so many different places, which is actually pretty cool. Pretty miraculous, wouldn't you say? Also, the Miraculous Ladybug uh, soundtrack album is available right now on iTunes for $9.99 as well as you can listen to it on Spotify. So it, when you're done with the movie or if you have watched the movie and you want to hear the, your favorite songs and soundtracks from the, movie, from the film, head over to iTunes and Spotify. Remember, to Spotify, you, need to let, you, you can obviously listen to it, listen to it for free. Uh, but I think you need like a like a subscription to uh, auto, you know, play like like control the way how you play your songs. I believe that's how Spotify works. And as and when for iTunes, freely listen to it on Apple Music, or just purchase uh, the album for nine dollars and ninety nine cents. All right, so uh, I guess that's it. Uh, I can't can't really think of anything else. Oh wow, there's four panel teams now. Okay, that that's that's a bit challenging. Uh, let's see what else. I can't really think of anything on top of my head. Oh yeah, well, speaking of uh, Christina V, uh, since she's a voice actor, but I might as well plug in her song. She released a brand new song. Um, I really, I, I don't know what what the song is called. I recently just saw it that she posted on Twitter. Hold on, let me, let me I'll, I'll, I'll try to uh, search for it. Well, since I'm down, I can, I can search for her song. I'm trying to search for a song right now. Ah, I'm getting an ad for a stupid video. No, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Come on. I did it! Oh, oh you have failed to defeat Pelty. No! Ah, dang it. No. No. I thought I had it. I thought I had it. Oh, well. I might as well search for Christina V's new song. Never Enough, The Greatest Showman cover. That's a brand new song that she recently just released um, a while ago. I don't think I can play it, a sample of it, because I don't want to get copyrighted, which is kind of ironic, because, uh, you know, I don't have any monetization. All right, start a battle from the lobby. There we go. Win three battles. 
I obviously didn't win three battles because, you know, I suck. But, whatever. Let's play. All right, this time we're going to go with Rising Cat Noir. Plat, claws out! All right, here we go. All right, panel teams. Come on, gather around. Let's gather around. Oh yeah, uh, I also put. Well, since we're on a new game, let's talk, let's let's talk about like a new topic, a new topic, shall we? Cataclysm. Cataclysm. <laughs> uh, I actually enjoyed um, uh, the movie. Uh, I even my favorite songs that that were um, my favorite songs. Spoilers. Uh, well, actually, not really a spoiler. Not really a spoiler. But the the songs that I really loved is um. You are Ladybug, Milady, Courage in Me, Stronger Together, and Chaos or Rain Today. Those are the songs that I liked. I mean, as well as the as the uh, the miraculous, uh, I guess, uh, opening credits like remix. It's, it's like a remix style of the miraculous theme song that we all know and love, but it's it's a uh, Lou and uh, it's Square. That's that that's the artist name. Don't, I don't know why it's called Square. It, it it's Square with with the V with the V instead of v, instead of U. That's all you need to know. Anyways, uh, those are my favorite songs from the album. Once again, on Apple Music, iTunes, and um, Spotify. All right, what's next? What's next? Uh, let's take up the movie for a bit. I'm I'm honestly not gonna spoil it. I feel like the ending of the movie was a bit rushed, especially uh, the uh, towards the the last the quote unquote final battle type deal. I feel like that was a bit too rushed. I mean, obviously they had a budget, but I really wish, I really wish the fight lasted a bit more longer. That's what I wish. But then, who am I to say? Come on, guys. All right, it's gonna hit me like that. Okay. One more. The Cataclysm wins. You have successfully defeated a penalty. Here's a reward. Thank you. Great job! You've hit level 6. Your, your new reward awaits you. Rest of your part. Awesome. Alright. Let's go. Let's go for okay. I want I want to redeem myself. Let's go. Let's go with this version of penalty one more time. Let's see this. Now this time we're always gonna be uh, Cat Noir, Rising Cat Noir. All right, here we go. Another new topic. I recently played the brand new Five Nights at Freddy's DL Security Breach DLC Ruin. Now let me just say that was a pretty pretty good game. Uh, I actually played it at uh, when when it, when it first released. I played it at two a.m. in the morning, and I I gotta admit it was not very healthy for me. <laughs> it was not good for me, cause I I got scared pretty hard. Cause obviously I'm playing a, a scary game in the middle of the night, and I was playing it with like with headphones on, so so that way the audio, the the TV audio wouldn't go. Like play throughout uh, my room, cause cause I mentioned this before. Uh, my room is next to my siblings, and they could like hear me, like and and, and they'll probably hear me recording this right now too. But I highly doubt it. But anyways, I didn't want them to hear the game audio, so I just just so I was just like playing it with headphones on. Anyways, I'm getting off topic. Um, they should probably fix that as a bug. But any but anyways, the jump scares were the, like the off jump scares from. Not like jump scares for like animatronics attacking you, but the jump scares like when it, when it randomly happened, like objects falling and all that. Those got me pretty good, and I did mention this to uh, like like Hannah the Chino and Akita the Chino from the Toya server. I actually did end up getting a few panic attacks. I had to like pause the game and calm myself down. Like, hey, everything's gonna be okay. Everything's gonna be alright, cause they got me pretty good. 
and also the suspense and the task I had to do. It was like Five Nights at Freddy's 3, uh, FNAF 1, uh, so many mechanics I had to learn. It was pretty rage inducing and, and pretty <laughs> scary. But yeah, hey, I managed. I managed. Uh, just thinking back to it, like, uh, I had. I, I was not kidding about the panic attacks. They were very serious. The jump scares. Ugh. I keep talking about the jump scares. Uh, the fourth one. The fourth one has been released. Okay. But yeah. It's a pretty good game. I'd say pretty better than like uh, Security Breach. Although I do love the, like, like the regular Security Breach. It was good. But the DLC man. Amazing. Steel did absolutely amazing. Uh, I'm pretty sure there are some bugs in the game. Uh, I know for a fact Daco actually mentioned it in one of his videos. So I can't wait for that bug to be fixed. That way I can I, I can finish everything that I'm trying to get. Cataclysm! There we go. But yeah. You yeah, successfully defeated the panel team. Here's a reward. Alright. We just need one more battle to win. And obviously we are going to do Stormy Weather. I wonder, uh, what's the next enemy that they might add? Hmm. Hopefully we'll find out soon. I wonder if there, reason I wonder if there was a reason that Tiki's here. Alright, stormy weather. Let's do this. Hmm. I'm assuming, that I'm assuming since I'm level 6, they should be level 6, unless the attacks are different. One more time as Raisin Cat Noir. And then I have to make a recipe. Alright, fire and ice enemies. Let's do this. Boom. Kill them all. Now let's wait for them to restart. Respawn. Come on. Come on. Hey, hey, hey. Show me what you got. Show me what you got. Oh, I didn't get all of them. Let's call out our cataclysm. cataclysm! Yeah, kill them. I'm trying to think of anything else that I should talk about, but I can't really think of anything. And I got knocked out. Wow, that I, I am offended by that. All right, that is animal abuse. And I just got okay. I'm I'm already at 55. Wow. Okay. Okay. I see how it is. Cataclysm! Oh yeah, one thing, Christina V is, a lot of people are upset that Christina V, the voice actor of Marina Dupin Chang, um, she isn't singing. I'm pretty sure Jeremy said that, that, uh, she promised a Lou, the singer, Lou, uh, who, who sung for Marina, that, uh, uh, he promised her that she would sing, and, and that's understandable, but I really wish, uh, maybe, um, in the future we will get to see Christina V singing. In Marinette's parts, that would be amazing. I know a lot of people would want that, and I really want, what, would like to see what uh, Marinette would sound like in Christina V's singing voice. Because Christina V is obviously she's amazing, she's talented. I can't if she does end up singing in the, in the future, and we get to see her versions. I can't wait for them to happen. Anyways, summer weather's here. Let's do this. Cataclysm. All right, come on, come on, we got this. Hey, come on. I wonder if this is getting tedious, cause I I am. In the past few videos, I am just like fighting. I'm afraid that's a bit tedious. Like that's just gonna bore my audience. You if I if I even do have an audience, that is. But uh. Okay, just just just. Just knock me off. Knock me off, why don't you? Well, this is a good chance. Well, since the first, this is a good chance to uh, plug in my TikTok at Jess Red Music. I have over 18,000 followers, as if that matters. But yeah, I do I do post some Raika's updates there, as well as some uh, good old one-on-one -on -one voice acting practices. 
I think I'm doing good. I want to be a voice actor one day. I hope to be a voice actor. Even if it's like a small little role. If I can do that, then that will be a big accomplishment. There we go. Stormweather is down for the count. You have successfully defeated Stormy Weather. Here's your reward. All right, let's. There we go. All right. Great job. You've hit level seven. Your new. Your new attack has a, has an has an uh, SFX. Hmm. They still have the ladybug. All right. Well, now that that's done. Yes, Mario Two Point Okay, time to cook a recipe. All right, I guess for that we're gonna have to for cooking. Hmm. For one magical macaroon. Okay. Ba -da -ba -da. What does my inventory look like? Okay. Okay. So I can make a plague macaroon. Or a. Or. Or a tiki macaroon, or a magic, or or a magic rune, <laughs> magic rune. All right, tiki cereal meal. I don't own that recipe yet, but I can make a multi a multi recipe. Yeah, I'll just I'll just go with one right now. I only need to do one anyways. Nice work. You successfully cooked up another delightful magic rune, and a magic rune does 100 XP. Congrats. For completing the quest, you have unlocked Safari. Heck yeah! All right, now we are gonna have to. Hmm. We are gonna have to make this daytime. There we go, daytime. All right. Now it's time for a good old. Oh, I'm getting an email. Oh, just just crunch roll. All right, now time for go. Time to go see Natalie. Uh, where is Natalie? I know I can type her name, but uh, I prefer to scroll, like, for some reason. Alright, I'll, I'll just type it out, because apparently I can't find her. I know for a fact I passed her. Nat. Natalie! There we go. There we go. Alright, now it's time to... Akuma. Akuma. Akumatize. All right, let's uh, actions and write. Natalie, be akumatized. I, I was trying to make up a line there, but I couldn't. That was not what I. That that's not what I. I, oh, I guess I need to do a, a mega commentization. Okay, well. Is this better? I guess I can't. No, I can't. Oh, well. Well. Well, that, that was a good old... That was a good old blooper. That was, that, that was nice. Alright, let's see if it's mega commentization that's supposed to happen. There we go, our Mega Akuma Natalie. There she is. Oh, she has red eyes. I, I haven't seen the episode yet. It's, that's kind of embarrassing on my part. Okay, so she has the tiger, the dragon, the pig, the fox, and the bee. Oh, and I, and I love her like 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 a uh, her camouflage. Her like her like red adurite camouflage. It's it's pretty maroon. Yeah, let's go for the lighting. See, take the basic military um, camouflage green color and put red in it. I would love to own a jacket like that. Now that looks pretty cool. That looks amazing. And and uh, her that's a is that a whip? Huh? Or is that a rope? Whip or rope? And she has something on her on her wrist. I guess that's for like a little device. Now, there is supposed to be a crossbow. That's it. There it is. Her crossbow. There we go. So, I seen a clip in the, of the episode. I haven't seen the full episode itself. 
but I have seen the episode where, um, I believe it's where it tracks, like, like, if the target's kind of more, it tracks it, like, no matter what. Anyways, let's, uh, let's play it. That's not what I meant. Oh, I guess I need to put on the action. There we go. And... Ooh. I would love it. Ah, oh, I, I wish it would just, like, shoot out, like, like a little arrow. That would have been awesome. But I do love, love the twirl she's doing. And... Boom. Face my wrath. Okay, thank you. Thank you, Safari. Thank you, Natalie. <laughs> Same purple shade as, uh, Shadamoth. But yeah, this is Safari. Nice job, Toya. She looks pretty cool. Pretty good. I can't- I wonder, uh, who, who might they add next? Which Akumatized villain they, they'll add next? But, yeah, that is it. That is all. Remember, if you want to get Natalie, all you need to do is get start a battle from the lobby win three battles doesn't have to be in a row just three battles in general and cook one single recipe and for time quest ozzy for mario 2.0 collect 10,000 lady terms i already have them so no point in me doing this all right anyways that's all for today folks hope you guys have a wonderful miraculous day and remember the miraculous movie is out right now as well as the album available on apple music iTunes and Spotify and YouTube as well because you can probably listen to it on YouTube music too. Anyways, hope you guys enjoy. Have a wonderful Miraculous Day and as always, I'll see you guys all next week for a brand new Miraculous RP update. Pound it! Stay Miraculous guys, stay Miraculous and don't forget to watch the movie.